if you want to perform a hard delete hard delete is something you know which you do not want to send to the recycle bin also you simply want to go ahead and delete all those records permanently okay now before i get into you know this hard delete part let's quickly understand what happens when a record gets deleted so when the record gets deleted uh technically let's understand what happens okay so functionally yes it, it gets deleted but uh, you know what happens to the to the records so actually those records remain in the same object so it doesn't you know it does not move to any other object or anything so if you have deleted accounts deleted accounts are also um, um you know the deleted accounts are also in the same object okay uh, technically what happens is i'll tell you um just give me one moment okay let's say this is your general object account object which has got all the data right now what happens to the deleted records your object usually has one field which is called is deleted okay it has got a field which is called is deleted this is a system field now this is deleted is a boolean type field checkbox boolean sort of a field which can only hold true or false by default the values of you know for all the records for this field is false okay by default but when you go and delete a certain record let's say you know i delete these first 10 records okay then what happens the records do not get deleted as such like you know the, if it gets deleted from the table then you know restoring it is not possible right technically what happens in the back end behind the scenes let's say these 10 records are deleted these 10 records will have is deleted changing to true got it now your recycle bin only shows the records where this is true okay and your usual tabs let's say you know when you go to the account tab now you will not see the deleted records under that because your usual account tab or a contact tab or opportunity tab only shows the records where it is false that is, that is the reason why you in recycle bin you only see the deleted records and in other tabs in the usual object tabs you only get to see the records which are not deleted okay now when you say restore what happens it again goes and changes it to let's say I restore this it again goes and changes it this to false got it now when this again changes back to false this will again start appearing then this will not appear in the recycle bin anymore it will again start appearing in your usual uh, list of records and you can retrieve it using your usual queries and stuff like that okay so that is the thing this is what happens technically in the backend okay now when you permanently delete something the record completely gets deleted like this now this value is not there anymore so now there is no scope for you to go back and retrieve or restore or anything got that so that is what uh, happens here all right okay so hard delete is the general delete is you know what we see here only is deleted value no for you to understand these things you know how to uh, you know retrieve the values of is deleted and all so those things you will eventually understand but technically i wanted you to all to understand what is happening in the back end so you know all these deleted records will be hidden from all the you know uh, uh, general list pages and all so you feel that you know these records are not there but these records still stay in the system okay now um, the other thing that we have to understand that there's a limit uh you know uh, to the storage of the recycle bin 
in case your recycle bin storage is getting a you know the limit there is getting exceeded then you know some of these records will automatically start getting permanently deleted okay and there is also a time uh, uh, limit for that uh, you know uh, so your records will stay in this stage for some time and after that they will be permanently deleted automatically okay so that is also there okay so now um, the other thing that we are talking about so usually this is the kind of delete so the delete operation in your data loader does this okay so this delete operation will only uh, you know delete the records but you know put them in re recycle bin hard delete will actually delete the records like this so this the records will not be in the system let's say these three records i want to hard delete now the records will not even be in the system they will be permanently deleted which means you will not have any scope of going and restoring them so sometimes you know you may be sure that yeah i want to do a hard delete go ahead and do a hard delete then okay so the process of hard delete is same as your normal delete same thing you can just browse you can choose a file and then you can say open next you know try to delete the records create or edit map same thing only one field to be mapped id field okay uh, select your uh, error or success log file and finally just go ahead and you know uh, delete i understand let me finish so here there is one more additional warning you are about to permanently delete data this can't be undone and records will not be available in your recycle bin so you have to check this checkbox and then you can go ahead and do the finish okay i'm not deleting it okay so that's how a hard delete works that's all we'll discuss in this video thanks for watching for more videos in this series you can look for the link in description below or visit my website goodbye and take care